Now, the next thing that we're going to talk about is these three buttons, right? And this is kind of actually easy, right? So this one is flip. As you can see, it's a load flip pose. And it basically, it's basically flipping the pose. So this is pose one. And you click that and it's flipped. Now, this one is select, right? It's going to select every bone that you have registered inside your post data, right? And it's going to be different. So this is the full body post. And if you select, it will select everything. And if you choose our hand post that we created later, uh, before, if you click this select, it's going to just select the, the finger bones. And so, yeah, so, so wait a minute. Why is it called something like that? Okay, now, so, uh, anyway, so the thing is, these uh, two buttons, right? The thing about that two buttons is that uh, these are actually identical. They do basically the same thing like these two buttons, right? So this is flip, right? And this one too is flip. They do exactly the same thing thing same thing with the select as you can see this one selects and this one also selects the bones and the only real difference between these two is that the position of it this one is in bone manager and this one is on the post panel and it's going to be much easier to see it here rather than going back and forth to bone manager so yeah that's it and the third button is our update pose button and this one is you is used if you want to edit update or tweak your post data so for example you want to create this uh so you, let's see our body pose walk right this one and right now let's say that i want to bring this uh the the legs to the middle something like that right and you want to update it to our body post walk 001. You can do that by clicking this update post next to the body post walk 001 and then click and check the yes I want to override it and click OK. Now if you load it, it has been edited, right? And yeah, that is our three buttons.